By the time I done got the bridge closed, all them zombies crossing, it was too late. So they got out of the town then. Man, I don't know. I've been in that little shit hut all day. I ain't got no time to be fucking around with them zombies. <laughs> you got something to say, you cross-eyed shit breath cracker ass son of a bitch? Wait, do we even have a plan? So we'll open the bridge, run really fast to the other side, and then close it. That sounds easy. It's foolproof. Wait, what if the zombies catch up to us? Yeah! Then run faster! Now I used to live here, so I can use the bridge. I gotta be ready for anything. These cracker white boys will shit on me first chance they get. Why'd you do that, you pasty white cracker man? I could've drowned. You're white, I'm a black man, I can't swim. But no, nobody cares about the black bridge man. Oh, and now here come the zombies. I done told you this shit would happen. But no, don't listen to me. Ah, shit. Why don't you just hit me with a fire hose while you're at it? Damn it, I knew it. The nigga always dies first! Fuck you, Cracker! Is this okay? What do you mean? We're three white guys leaving a black guy to die. Isn't that kind of what I went to court for? Hell, I ain't dead yet! Well, he is black after all. Fuck you! So? So, uh, he's probably used to it by now. Oh, you bad! Certainly sounds that way. Alright, let's go. Oh, fuck all you honking! No, 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 don't eat that! Don't eat that! Not my big black dick! Not my big black dick!
Perfect. Now I can cross to the boat. What? How could my infallible lawyer logic have failed me? My plan was foolproof. I need to dig deeper. Get lawyerier. Perfect. By using my judge prowess, there have been zero miscalculations. Fellows, have you come to join us? Who are you? Sorry, I don't speak retard. Who are you? Now that I understand. Who are you? We're the resistance. What the hell do you even have to resist? Them zombies. They seek to oppress us and restrict our way of life. They'll impede on our rights. Will you join us and fight the good fight? Yeah, no. no. Fuck you. Zombies on the way! It's time. What? You've got the grenade. Look out, Freeman! Why didn't I help her? Why am I up here? How do I get down from here? How did I get up here? When did I get up here? Maybe I can jump down. No, that's just stupid.
Johnson, do you uh, recognize that white guy from episode four? Do you uh, remember Gerald? I want what was done to Gerald to be done to him. I don't care how it happens. I want it done. It's time to finish things. And now for the final step. Zombies! Zombies! Ow! How did you get up there? How did I get up here? I don't know. I don't know. Oh well. What's the password? Nipple butter. Oh, correct. Now what? The zombies are everywhere. I have one idea. But it's risky. How risky? We might get caught by the zombies. We'll meet at the top of that building. You can see the whole city from there. So we can figure out where to go next? Right. Now I'll go first. I might be old, but I know my way around. It's Dr. Beanor, the lawyer! We found you. Now you're coming with us. Wait, what the fuck? Son of a bitch! We have to get Dr. Beanor back. But why? He had a plan! <laughs> Run! Run! 
Hombre, ¿qué haces aquí? Si sí, esto es nuestro territorio. Oh no, my one weakness, Mexicans. ¿Tú no se amaste en mexicanos? Soy puertorriqueño, hijo de perra. No los califiques, maricón. Pero Héctor, ¿tú eres mexicano? Oh, sí. ¡Mierda, la policía! No, I didn't do nothing. Nipple butter, 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 Is this him? Nipple butter! Yes, sir! Good work. <laughs> Nipple butter! Thank you, sir! That jerk keeps shouting the password. At this rate, the enemy might already know what it is. But we should be fine now that we found you. Hey! I know you! You're the reason I had to hang out with George, who made me hang out with Gerald, who got killed, which is why I need to leave the country. I had to go to jail for that. Yeah, nice recap, by the way. Dr. Beanor? How do you get here? I had my men retrieve him. And when they arrived without you and Carl, we sent them back out to find you. Still, if Dr. Beanor won my case, and you didn't rule against me, then this never would have happened. The governor had his plan ready to go for a good six years now. All he needed was one racist thing to happen. He decided to close in on your case. The fact that you threw a black man off a building just made it easier. But what does that have to do with the zombies? I'm getting to that. The zombies are incredible bigots. Without a racist act to stir them on, they'd kind of just stand around, doing nothing. But if that's all he needed, why does he want me gone? And why the zombies? I may be able to answer that, but we won't know for sure until we reach that building. Dr. String, there's something on the screen. Shit's getting too real now. It's powerful nuke. We ought to be in great distance from explosion or to dying in shitty way. That's a nuke? That's a mini nuke. It can only take out a city block. Everything else will be fine. That sounds stupid. Well, that's CSS. There's something else! Good work. What's happening? This is starting to get really stupid. Actually, this could be just what we need. What? The confusion will make it easier for us and these cops to move about the streets. So, do you know the plan? This is it. Jack. Dr. Beanor? One day you will tell this story to your grandchildren. And when you get to this part, you need to be able to tell them. Racists did the zombies. I... I don't get it. Well, so much for you being the smart one. What? Let's go. Look! Don't worry about him. We'll see him soon enough. Nipple butter! That's the, the password. password! How did I get up here? I put you up there. What? Defense lawyers can split themselves into two aspects. I don't really know why, 
It's just a law of nature. Everything he's got left that matters to his plan is still in the plant. If that mini nuke can finish the job that the soldier started, he won't be able to make any more zombies. Did you hear that? Yes, sir. They're on their way. Look! On the other building! Wait, I know you! Jack, I thought you were leaving the country. You can't do that if you're in the capital. Well, I've been trying, but why? I think I can answer that now. You performed the racist act he needed. He thought you caught on to his plan, so he needed to silence you. But I guess he didn't realize that you're a complete fucking idiot. That was his undoing. Then why not just give me a plane ticket out of here? Please, I can't dirty my hands and my bank account with something like that. It was easier and more racist to have a black man on my payroll force you to hang out with a black gangsta, whose death I can easily frame you for. Well, I guess that didn't work. Eh, not as well as I wanted, but it still worked out just fine. Despawn that cop. Turn him around. Why? Do you see that? That's everything you've worked for getting butt fucked. Johnson, how very like you to infiltrate this group. Who do you think called CSS for help with the zombies? Even if the zombies don't take over, I called for and cooperated with the CSS soldiers to fix the problem. But what about the soldiers that just kill everyone? They're defectors who will be dealt with at the counter-terrorist discretion, regardless of whether or not they actually defected from me. Well, you're, you're just a bald, cheating faggot! Wow, Jack. That was not cool. Johnson! Nipple butter. I should have known you were a sleeper agent. How very racist. Not a sleeper agent. A double agent. Well, that's just racist. Will you stop saying that? Jack, this started with you. So you have to be the one to end it. I totally get it now. So does this mean I don't have to leave the country anymore? Oh, come on. Who is this stupid? We finished what we started. Now life can go back to normal. That sounds stupid. Ah, uh, well, that's Gmod.
Why? Why are you doing this? Why? Why? I did it because you're a chick. That's racist. And that's my car, you asshole!